Hey guys, so today I'm going to do a quick August favorites video. Um, I just have a couple things here that I want to talk to you about. A couple of my favorite things that I've been using this month. Um, that's it. Let's just get started. So first off, let's start with my MAC palette. I absolutely love this one that I've done. Um, I, I have a couple, like what, like seven other ones that I have or more. I don't even know. But I built this whole one this month. Um, it has just nudes in it, which I love. I don't know why I've never had one that is just all nudes. Um, it has a whole bunch of different colors in it. If you want me to get into more detail about this, I can make another video. Um, I'm just gonna keep going. Uh, the next thing is MAC Viva Glam 5. It's just like a great everyday color. You can wear it anytime, anywhere, with anything. Um, it's just good for like, like a quick lip. Like it's nothing too bold and it's nothing too nude where it's like, oh, you, you have concealer on your lip. It's like the perfect, perfect nude. Next for makeup is Studio Fix Fluid. And this is NW22 if you guys care. Um, I love Studio Fix right now. I used to do Studio Fix a long, long time ago. I've kind of moved around a whole bunch, but I've come back to this one, especially with like summer coming to an end and fall kind of starting up. It's nice to have a little bit more coverage for fall and winter, so I've I picked up a new Studio Fix fluid, um, and I've fallen back in love with it. It's been a long time since I've used just Studio Fix, and I'm wearing that today, and I love it. It's it's awesome. Next, we have a couple things for skincare. We have the Lightful Softening Lotion, which um, is kind of like a toner. Um, it's just like basically water, sort of. I just put it in my hand, rub it around, and pat it into my skin and let that soak in for probably a, like a couple minutes, like two, three minutes. And then I put on my Dior Serum. This is um, just like the multi, perf like multi, Perfection like it's just about everything um, I like it. it's super thick which is weird for like a serum normally I think of serums as something that's very like thin and kind of like um, I don't want to say oil, but it's like it's almost thin like an oil and you put it on and it kind of just sits there or whatever But this one's a little bit thicker and I like that because I feel like I'm kind of like rubbing it into the skin um, It's been fantastic. I like it this month. I feel like Ever since I've used it, like, foundations have gone on smoother, um, my skin, like, hasn't been so red, because I have a lot of, like, redness in my skin, especially for shaving and all that stuff, and it helps kind of tone all that down. The last thing is the Ultra Repair Cream. Um, I absolutely love this. I don't know what I would do without it. My skin was breaking out there for a little bit of, like, a, a couple weeks during August, and, um... I realized that I ran out of this and then my skin started breaking out, so I started using this again and everything got better. Um, I love it because you can use it everywhere and um, makes makeup go on so smoothly and it doesn't get on me, I don't know about anyone else, but on me it doesn't get too oily throughout the day. Sometimes moisturizers that are a little bit too thick kind of get oily on my nose or my T-zone, but this stays just the same throughout the whole day and I absolutely love that. Uh, last couple things. Uh, BioTrue. Um, absolutely love this from my contacts this month. I used something that was like more of like a generic drugstore brand and my contacts would dry out like towards the like end of the day, like more evening. And um, ever since I switched to this one, they've been hydrated all day. My eyes don't feel like I have to scratch them out of my head um, at like eight or something at night. So after I switched to BioTrue, I can wear them all day, all night, and it's perfectly fine. And the last thing for kind of like beauty skincare stuff is the Glow Toothpaste. This month I've been using this all the time. I absolutely love it. I think it's strange that I like this one because I love like minty toothpaste. I feel like I've done a video on this one before, but absolutely love the Glow Toothpaste. It's like a berry flavor, which is weird, but it's so good and it does an amazing job. Also this month I've been drinking a lot more coffee than I've ever used to. Um, just because I've been staying up later and working harder and I just need coffee. So my teeth, I actually have noticed a difference getting more yellow. And then I started using the Glow Toothpaste. Fantastic. It brought my smile back to where I like it to be. Um, 
and it doesn't make doesn't make my teeth sensitive or anything. I feel like sometimes people have said that like the Crest 3D wipe makes their teeth sensitive. I've never experienced that, but this one's this one's super gentle. So moving on to other things that I've really enjoyed this month, um, my iPod Classic. Do people even know what this is anymore? But um, I always had this in my car um, just for like emergencies because I always have my phone in my car and that has like Bluetooth and it just like plays. But um, if my phone's dead or something, I always listen to this. But I have literally just been listening to this everywhere. I think why I like it so much is because it's only music and there's not distractions like Tumblr or Instagram or any of that stuff on your music device. So you just experience the music and um, you don't get distracted with checking emails or watching someone's YouTube video or something like that. So I've favorited this a lot this month. Absolutely love that. Um, it's just weird because it's like old technology, but not really old technology, but I like it. The last techie type thing that I like this month is um, I've been Instagramming a lot and I've been following a lot more people on Instagram and I've just kind of fallen in love with Instagram a lot more. And um, yeah, I love Instagram and then Vine, I've been kind of like obsessed with Vines recently. I've never really gotten into it, but I got into it this month. And then Twitter, absolutely have no idea what I was doing not caring about Twitter. Um, I always thought Twitter was like some silly little thing because you like only could type like 160 characters or whatever. But I've been following a lot of people on there and it's so addicting. Like I have it set to like mess like in plays like the little message tone whenever I get like a, a tweet from someone that I'm following and people are like, what's that noise? It keeps going off. I'm like, oh, it's just Twitter. And I'm, it's just obsessed with Twitter. Um, so yeah, those are some of the apps that I've been following a lot of on my phone this month. And that's everything. I have more stuff that I could talk about, like sunglasses and silly stuff, stuff like that, but um, these are the main things. Oh, one more, just kidding. Um, my wallet, I got this from the Market, ugh, the Mark Jacobs store when I was in Hawaii. I love it, it's gigantic, holds like money and receipts and um, all my cards and everything. I love it. Anyway, that's everything. That's officially everything now. Um, I hope that you have a great day. Thank you for watching this video. It's been a long time. It's so much fun making videos. I don't know why I stop and take so much time in between each video that I make. I really, really, really want to start getting into making a video hopefully like once a week. I really want to start doing that. So this is video one of the new push to doing YouTube videos. Um, if there's anything you guys want to see, just comment below and let me know. Other than that, you can follow me on Instagram and keep up to date with my life that way. Um, talk to you guys soon. Bye.